fights, he's rebelled against stereotypes his entire life. He's turned to boxing to help overcome addiction. Well, I think there's still a lot of typical stereotypes out there, and I think this, this is kind of going to help uh, deal away with a lot of those. I'm not your, your typical stereotype, as you can see. I'm, uh, and when I get up in the ring on June 15th, I'm going to be not only fighting for myself, but I'm going to be fighting for the whole community. On June 15th, Mac will turn pro, a milestone for an openly gay fighter. Mac's promoter says his sexuality has never been an issue. Because he doesn't look like, like he, does, he doesn't strike you as being a gay guy, especially coming into a boxing gym. And it's very, I know that there is, but it's very difficult for them to come out. But Mac doesn't see this bout as a coming out party. His sexuality is just one part of who he is. And it's important to Mac to stay true to himself. That's the message he wants to spread. Always be comfortable in your own skin. Don't worry about other people's judgment. Um, if they insist on judging you and labeling you, then you just hunker down and, and fight through it and show them what you can do. And you, at the end of the day, you stand your ground and you be who you are. And uh, you stand tall and proud. Mac has been grateful for the amount of support he's received from the community. His promoter says he'll ultimately let his fighting do the talking. Johnny is willing to spar with anyone who has a problem with it. And he's willing to fight anyone who has a problem with it. We have contracts and stuff for that. I can pay you very well. When Johnny Mac steps into the ring at the LeBron Center in June for his first pro bout, he's not just fighting his opponent. And uh, I think when they see what I can do in the ring, they're, they're going to really start to think about what we can do together to do away with these stereotypes. Whitney Oikel, Global News, Halifax.